Hi, here's a quick guide on how to process payroll in Telenox. In your main dashboard, basically you can just click on your payroll module. The first page that you see is the process payment, step one. In here, basically you'll be able to choose any of the payroll months that you want to process. You can choose either that you want to process a full month payroll or even bi-monthly, first half or second half of the month. Active employees will be automatically checked. Resigned employees are automatically unchecked so that you won't accidentally process your resigned employees payroll. Once done, click on the next button. So our leave and payroll app is uh, sync in a way, in a way uh, whereby whenever the employee applies for no pay leave and is approved, it's automatically sync over to step two, leave payments and deductions. So in here, basically we will show the uh, deduction amount for each of the day and we will total the amount at the bottom. After that, just click on the next button. Step three, select pay item, basically allows you to add additional pay items on top of the basic salary, which is already synced from your employee profile. So in here, basically you'll be able to add in other pay items like allowance or even commissions. From the drop down list, you can choose other items. If you need to delete any of the payments, you can just click on the delete button. Any recurring payments that you process under monthly payments or deduction is considered as a recurring payment, means that it will be auto saved and auto displayed uh, in subsequent payroll months. Under ad hoc, basically you'll be able to process other items like, um, like bonus or even reimbursement. If you are uh, paying out uh, overtime pay, under hourly daily attendance, you'll be able to choose either hourly, uh, either overtime days or overtime hours. If you process a uh, public holiday pay, then uh, you can choose this option as well. And rest day pay if they work on a non-working day. Once done, just click on the next button. Under step four, view summary. Basically, this is a page where you can double check all your payments that you've already keyed in in step three. Once done, just click on the process view, uh, CPF and view net payment. And once you have arrived at month total, this means that you've already completed your payroll processing. It's that easy.